What's up guys, it's Jeff Fong here and welcome to another video. So for today's vlog, we are gonna unbox the Easy Boost 350 in Earth color weight. So let's go! And according to you guys, based from what I saw or based from what I watched from the vlog of Sneaker Talk dun sa unboxing niya ng Yeezy 350 Earth, then um, according to you guys, these are the worst Yeezy colorway that's ever released ng, ng Adidas or ng Yeezy. Um, for me, it's not the worst colorway for me because, ah, I mean, um, you know guys that um, my collection is Jordan 1 but sa Yeezy, pag papiliin mo ako, um, I'll pick the syempre yung OG colorway, yung um, Yeezy 700 Wave Runner which I have also and yung Yeezy 500 in blush colorway or yung bone. Halos same same lang naman yung color ng Yeezy 500 but for the 350s, I have one before. I have a blue tint tapos meron din akong um, sesame which is um, I like the most because kung sa Easy 350s lang kami ng fiance ko, mas gusto namin talaga yung OG which is the version 1, yung may Oxford Tans, Turtle Dove, ganyan, pero super tasa ng price niya. And I think dun sa Easy Earth, I think siya yung pinaka-closest sa uh, version 1 which is the Oxford Tans. Kaya nagustuhan ko yung color niya. And um, um, one reason na binenta ko yung dalawang Easy ko, yung Blue Tint sa yung Sesame is um, hindi ko siya size because because snug fit talaga ang Yeezy 350s and for the sizing guide nun, dapat you should go half size up sa mga lalo na kung wide yung feet mo dapat half size up ka unlike yung sa Yeezy 500 and sa Yeezy 700 2 to size siya um, I have those yun nga, I have one in blush and meron ako ng 700 na wave runner and I got it in size 10 lang which is my true to size na na size sa shoes and sa Jordan 1 and sa Yeezy 350 I go half size up parate kasi sa 350s it's snug fit nga and sa Jordan 1 naman I don't know sa iba true to size siya based from sa mga napapanood ko na na reviews true to size siya pero for me kasi wide yung 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 feet ko so nag half size up rin ako kasi pag yung size 10 for the length sakto siya but Doon sa gilid, yung sa may sides ng paa, parang ano siya eh, um, pag sinot ko lang siya okay, pero once I wore it, tas nilakad ko, parang ang sikip niya, so I go half size up, um, parate sa Jordan 1 and sa 350s. Ayun nga, um, may nag-comment nga doon sa isang photo ko na parang, parang ang nilakad, <laughs> na parang ang laki daw nung, nung, tawag dito, ang laki daw ng shoes sa paa ko. Sabi ko, uh, medyo malaki nga siya tignan but I need to go half size up kasi snug fit nga yung Jordan 1. So, ang haba ng sinabi ko but ayun nga, ang point ko lang is for me, these are the these are not the worst um, Yeezy 350 sneaker released for me ah, kasi yung mga nirelease niya before halos same na lang ang shade eh, parang that yun nga, yung kasama nito release yung the daylight, yung mga scent, yung mga citrine halos for me, halos same same shade siya and pag meron ko na isa parang hindi mo na kailangan bumili ng um, ibang colorway unless unless fan ka talaga and you collect um, Yeezy 350s, especially 350s pero this for me yung parang earth na brown colorway niya is kakaiba and parang feel ko ngayon, ngayon lang ako nakakita, I mean um, hindi usual yung colorway na brown or yung parang greenish brown earth tone sa shoes and that's what I that's what I like about these shoes. So let's head on over to the shoes na. And here's the shoes. So before I open the box, um, this collection or this shoes is part of a release na parang ginawa nilang um, regional exclusive na parang I think isa yun sa pinaka uh, I think isa yun sa factor kung bakit um, nagustuhan ko siya kasi parang uh, meron siya ng parang limited or parang exclusive na vibe so 
Um, they released yung Taillight, which I'm gonna show here. They released yung Taillight sa Europe. And yung, and this one, yung Earth, they released this at um, US and here in Asia, or in India, I think. Um, we got the flax colorway, which is nice also. And they released yung three colorways ng sneakers last February um, 22, if I'm not mistaken. And the SRP or the retail price of this is around $220 or around 11500 to 12000 But the resale price of this goes around mga... 18 to 20k mga ganun, or 90 to 20,000 or some sell it at 21,000 because yun nga it's um it's a it's a limited sneaker and it's a regional exclusive release a sneaker so we got this from a reseller as well um thanks to sir jack Yu of hbk sneakers i'm gonna put his instagram link here and on the description box below as well so at the end of this video, I'm gonna show you three style guides or three outfits kung paano ko style yung um, Yeezy 350s so, so let's start with the box right here. So it's your usual Yeezy box and at the top it has the model number which is, I got this, the Yeezy 350 and on the left side we have this, the details. I think this is a good way to legit check your pair, yeah. Usually it's in the center, we have the size, there it's... We have the code, it's um, earth, earth, and earth. Then on the other side we have this, the Easy Boost 350 made by Adidas. And we have the Adidas Originals logo over here. And at the bottom part it's blank and at the back part it's blank as well. So let's open the sneakers, the box. So here we got the, we got a normal tissue paper, sneaker tissue paper, there. So nice. And so my first impression about these shoes is, it reminds me of the version one talaga yung Oxford pants. I mean, this is the closest colorway na release ng version 2 na pinaka-closest sa Oxford pants. Kasi ang ganda eh. I mean, it's very neutral. And I think yung color niya, um, nag-depend sa lighting. Um, based from what you can see now, it's kind of brown. But based from the photos that I saw sa um, Instagram, meron dun parang medyo nag-greenish yung vibe niya or the dark it depends eh kung I mean some nakita ko ibang articles parang or na vlog sinasabi nila parang um niloko daw sila ng Adidas kasi yung colorway daw na nasa picture hindi yun yung nasa or nakuha nila or in order nila pero um ang masabi ko lang is it's um based sa lighting kasi talaga which I like kasi um na iba iba yung color niya. I mean, based sa lighting, so it's unique and it's different from other Easy 350s. So before I describe the shoe, I'm gonna give you a quick preview of what the shoe looks like. Bitch, I'ma go all the way up. They keep calling my phone. They catching on to the bus. I got it out of the mud, but I'ma go all the way up. Bad girl from the shore, she taking me out of the world. Okay, okay. Go Wave. Nice guy with a cold shoulder. You be cool, but I don't know you. Roll a flower and I'm off the potion. Give me superpowers and I won't stop to the bank roll on super massive. Big bank for the space chatter. Way up in a squad NASA. Couple filled with the dark magic. Subtle flex when I run a race. So let's start with the upper panel of the shoes, which is made out of full prime net material. I mean, I don't know if same siya dun sa mga... I'm not sure if same siya dun sa mga blue tints na batch na yun. Pero I think this is more comfortable. Kasi parang medyo mas malambot siya. And sa may lateral part niya, we can see a see-through panel over here. And if you're... Um, if, and if you want to experiment with your socks, pwede, like, kunyari, you can wear a red socks para medyo kita siya here sa see-through panel. Ayan, nakikita niyo yung finger ko. But over here, sa may back part niya, meron siyang black part. I think ito yung parang 
cushion niya and dito rin meron siyang konting um, paddings but yung sa may pinaka middle part ng lateral part there's a see-through panel which you can play around with different colors of socks to make it more stylish and as the box said um, the colorway of this or the code of this is earth earth and earth so for earth colorway lang talaga siya and on the midsole naman i think it's a different color or different tone or shade na brown or earth dun sa full prime knit na top and as you can see it's a full ridged up midsole ayan surrounding it as normal sa mga version 2 and sa back part niya this one um, dun sa mga iba, I mean dun sa mga blue tints, hindi siya like sobrang laki ng different na shade but for this one I think they experimented it a bit and I like it and it has a different color of the back heel part this yung pull tab niya heel part it's a different color from the prime knit the upper prime knit and it's a different color from the midsole as well but it is the same with the laces so um, I like the colorway of this talaga because I think um, I can wear it with many outfits and I think the color is very versatile Ganyan. and let's head on over to the outsole naman. so the outsole is as you can see we can notice the pop of color yellow at the heel part which says boost and and this and let's check the other pair because I've seen this earlier and there's a um, not factory defect or parang yan, or I think it's a quality control issue and there's a splatter or parang sobrang yellow na paint over here but it doesn't matter because it's not that much I mean, pag you mo naman siya, hindi naman may kita para yung outer sole or outsole. And before I forget, here's what the insole of the shoes or the shoe looks like. There. So we have this. We have the Adidas Originals logo and the Yeezy. So if it's original, it's um, well printed and malinis yung pagka-print niya. And here's the bottom part. And we have this, yung size no insole, it's 10 to 11. Then at the back heel part, you can see this. It's a, I think it's a reflective material and based from dun sa blue tins ko and sa sesame, it has this as well. And one tip, if nakamali ka in order and if you got your size, na kunyari, na true to size, kunyari, if you're 10, then you got a 10 and you should go half size up now because it's snug. Uh, one trick is you can remove this you insole the shoes and it will leave you it will give you more space. And lastly, here's what the tag of the shoe or the shoes looks like. So you, this will help you um legit check a pair as well. And that's it. Um for the sizing, as I've mentioned earlier, go half size up. That's proven na, I mean, for from all the vlogs that I've seen, from all the Instagram posts that I've seen, go half size up from your usual, um, for, from your normal size because it's super snug or it's snug fit. Um, I would give this shoes a 9.5 or 9 out of 10 rating because I like the colorway. Comfort din naman natin matatanong yan because it's easy boost na. And that's it. Here's a style guide for you guys. Dust, little baddie off the cellular. Talking life and I will set it up. I'm a sharp shooter. Yeah, Will Smith. Call me Prince Park. Let me freshen up. Bay boy on a level up. Way up near the nebulas. Uh, I'm never copping a chain because I see it all through the frames. And I leave it all on the page. It's feeling like they want me locked in a cage. They want us all in the fake shit. But I'ma go all the way A pretty. Cause I don't feel all the way safe. Here. Nah. Spray the champagne, shower up in the air. Stun the goggles, what the fuck is the flu? Untamed and she wide off the goose. Ghost ride, bitch, I come through the roof. Fuck 12, cause they all on my tail. Hella wild and I break all the rules. Chill, chill, bro, you wear the line. So for the first look, let's start with what I'm wearing right now. So I am wearing a a Adidas um have a nice day collab shirt, Adidas jogging pants. 
um, a eight bucket hat to complement the earth uh, military look of this one and one tip if you want to like highlight your shoes um, wear a monochrome outfit it's either black or white na hindi masyado pansinin para yung focus nila or yung attention nila sa shoes mo lang talaga so here's the look you don't know what's the mood bitch I'ma go all the way up they keep on calling my phone they catching on to the bus I got it out of the mud but I'ma go all the way up Bad girl from the store, she taking me out of this world, bitch. I'ma go all the got way. Got the JD spinning, got the Katie spinning, I'm outrageous with it, going crazy with it. Got the phrase jumping off the page, gifted, got the waves pushing, got the neighbors tripping, got the trap booming, jumping off the speakers, drip on me, jumping off the easel. Go risky, couldn't tell me shit, bitch. Nah, bought a fist, cooking the bar. So for the second look, let's go for a more casual, more daily look. So I decided to wear a um, camouflage shorts, cargo shorts, and pair it with a the hundreds gray tee which I got from the nines and top the look with a um, new era cap then yun just gonna wear it with the shoes um, with a foot socks pwede para hindi masyadong pansinin yung high socks then so here's the look Turn a lab into a living kitchen. Niggas grimace when I water with it. Slut of flexing in the candid image. Come from pushing in the S type with no license. Gas load of windows tinted. Still couldn't see me with the zoom on your little vision. Nah, we are not the same. We got different lists. No one snapping like we something real. Fit to keep it realistic. Quick to split it with my day ones. Got the label making bank runs. Cause the train of thought like a freight, huh? I'm the type to get a late start. You the type to be afraid, huh? I'm the type to never have things. You the type to have a maid, huh? Yeah. Wave. And I keep you to the flame, huh? How they got me going this hard. Really, I'm the type to never say much. For the third look naman, let's go with a more experimental, more stylish look. So I'm gonna wear it with a Uniqlo shade cut denim pants, a white shirt, plain white shirt, and a plaid polo to top off or to finish the look. So let's go. Turn a lab into a living kitchen. Niggas grimace when I water with it. Slut of flexing in the candid image. Come from pushing in the S type with no license. Gas load of windows tinted. Still couldn't see me with the zoom on your little vision. Nah, we are not the same. We got different lists. No one snapping like we something real. Fit to keep it realistic. Quick to split it with my day ones. Got the label making bank runs. Cause the train of thought like a freight, huh? I'm the type to get a late start. You the type to be afraid, huh? I'm the type to never have things. You the type to have a maid, huh? Yeah. Wave. And I keep you to the flame, huh? How they got me going this hard. Really, I'm the type to never say much. And there, hope you guys enjoyed this vlog about the Easy Earth 350 version 2. And if you have questions sa sizing, sa colorway, kung, kasi I've, I've mentioned earlier na gibay yung colorway niya, depende sa light, um, you can message me on Instagram or you can follow me at I am Jeff Ong and I'm gonna answer your questions. And kung gusto niyo magpasend ng photo ng shoes, I can send it to you. If you have questions, then you can ask them on the comment section below. Um, please don't forget to click the notification bell here or here para ma-notify kayo if I have a new video. But for this time, I'm gonna upload two videos per week. So, um, so stay tuned and yun, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you in the next one. Bye. See you all through the frames and I leave it all on the page. It's feeling like they want me locked in a cage. They want us all on the fake shit, but I'ma go all the way A with it, cause I don't feel all the way safe here. Nah, spray the champagne, shower up in the air, stun the goggles, what the fuck is the flu? Untamed, and she wide off the goose, ghost ride, bitch, I come through the roof. Fuck 12, cause they all on my tail, hella wild, and I break all the rules. Chill, chill, bro, you out of line. You don't know what's the mood. Bitch, I'ma go all the way up. They keep on calling my phone, they catching on to the bus. I got it out of the mud, but I'ma go all the way up.